morning friends uh, today we discuss regarding uh, dr isotherm so the formula will be ln q equal to ln qm minus beta epsilon square where we can see q is the unit will be millimolar per gram so see q is the amount of metal ions adsorbed per gram of the adsorbent at equilibrium so beta uh, unit will be mole square k kilojoule raised to minus 2 so beta is the is a constant related to mean adsorption energy also you can say dr equation constant this is the polynomial potential epsilon so epsilon formula you write r into t ln in bracket 1 plus 1 by c so here uh, capital T is the absolute temperature in Kelvin and R is the universal gas constant where we can take a value 8.314 joule per mole Kelvin. This is the unit okay and uh, QM is the adsorption capacity milligram per gram unit and also you can say DR monolayer capacity. So capital E is the mean free energy and the formula will be E equal to 1 divided by root 2B so you need to take another kilojoule per milligram or kilojoule per mole so you draw a graph land q versus epsilon square so you can uh, find out the slope and intercept here you can see here y equal to mx plus c formula you are using here c is the intercept and mx is the slope so slope will be minus beta and intercept will be ln QM. For that, to find out the beta and uh, QM value, so what is uh, we under some uh, DR isotherm equation is which is more generally used to distinguish physical and chemical adsorption. DR model has been generally used to express adsorption based on pore filling mechanism with the Gaussian energy distribution on heterogeneous surface and a DR model explains the adsorption nature and is usually used to determine the mean free energy of the sorption process. So a mean free energy formula will be I say equal to 1 by root 2b kilojoule per mole is the unit where the E value is used to <coughs> assertion the type of adsorption process under considerations if 8 is greater than e and e is less than 16 means the value will be lies between 8 and 16 so mole uh, you know it will be kilojoule per mole the sorption process is chemisorption if the value will be in between 8 and 16 the sorption process is chemisorption if e is less than 8 kilojoule per mole indicate a physical adsorption process where e, e of sorption per molecule of the sorbate when it is transferred to the surface of the solid from infinity in the solution. So dr isotherm model was applied to the data in order to deduce the heterogeneity of the surface energies of adsorption and the characteristic porosity of the adsorbent. So, see here if the 8000 to 16 within the value 8000 above and 16000 below that is chemical adsorption and less than 8000 that is physical adsorption. Thank you.